Nintendo has been killing it lately with the sales of their console, the Nintendo Switch. And while PS4, Xbox One, and PC will always be on top from a hardware power perspective, Nintendo has mastered the art of making a well-made, on-the-go, portable console experience. But what games should you play? Hey Shackers, Greg here, and today I'm counting down the best games to buy and play on your Nintendo Switch. Now keep in mind, this will be for the year 2017, since the Switch library is expanding at an alarming rate. That said, let's get ready to dispute the multiple Nintendo claims even though this video is fair use. These are the top 10 Nintendo Switch games you need to play. You're not Nintendo! You're... You're Pretendo! You're all... race TRAITORS! Sure, it's the third time Bethesda has re-released this awesome Elder Scrolls game, but it being portable is a big deal. Yes, the game looks incredible on PC, and mods improve the gameplay experience tremendously, but having it on such a small hardware device is impressive, even if the game is over 6 years old. It's still a blast to play on the go, and the amiibo support, although gimmicky, is fun. Venture forth into the world of Skyrim one more time on Nintendo Switch. It feels like somebody wants to sell me something! <laughs> I told you he was on to us! I have to admit, I'm not a big fan of Japanese RPGs. However, that doesn't mean I don't recognize a good game when I see one and Xenoblade Chronicles 2 is everything JRPG fans will love. Its deep combat system, along with a huge world and story to explore, makes it perfect for the on-the-go Nintendo Switch hardware, even if I have no idea how the gameplay works. Those who fight together with synthetic life forms called blades, like Rex does, are known as drivers. When drivers do battle, their weapons and powers are granted to oh, them by God. blades, such as Pyra, for example. Up to three drivers and three blades can work together at any time. As you continue attacking with your normal weapons, you constantly work towards charging oh, up your driver arts. Okay. These special abilities run the gamut, with some allowing you to inflict extra damage. Enough! Do you want my head to explode? In the name of all that is good and decent! No more for today! Sonic has been dragged through the mud over at Sega. However, Sonic Mania is one giant leap in the right direction. Featuring everything that made the classic Sonic games of old great, it returns as a remix of sorts. New levels, music, it's a fantastic mix-mash of the Speedy Blue Hedgehog. This solid sprite-based speedy platform game makes a comeback and it feels great. Maybe there is hope for the Blue Hedgehog after all. He's the fastest thing alive! He's the fastest thing alive! He's the fastest thing alive! Everything has clearly gotten out of hand now. But it was It's Doom on Switch, for sake. That's all that needs to be said. Now enjoy it. If someone ever tells you there are no good multiplayer games on Switch, simply point to Splatoon 2. The game is creative, fun, and has player events that are a blast to participate in. No, it's not the eSport Nintendo thought it would be, but it's still a great game on Nintendo Switch. When is 
a Mario Kart game not fun? Okay, well most of the time, it's a joy to race around a Nintendo-themed track as Donkey Kong on a motorcycle. It's one of the flagship games in Nintendo's library and makes fantastic use of creative tracks and colors. It's fun online or couch co-op, and the battle mode is always enjoyable. It's nearly a mandatory purchase if you own a Nintendo Switch, so don't be without it. have dreamed of a portable Rocket League, and finally that dream is realized, with Rocket League finally coming to Nintendo Switch. And if that wasn't enough, major updates are coming to the game itself. Soon you'll be able to play with anyone on any platform, be it PC, Xbox, PS4, and of course, Nintendo Switch. It's the portable sports fun of pushing a ball with Hot Wheels cars. Now literally everyone can enjoy it. Who would have ever thought that Nintendo and Ubisoft would make such a great fantastic crossover? Mario Plus Rabbids is a kid-friendly XCOM-like game that uses strategy and tactics as well as having all the rabbit humor the series is known for. Combine that with your favorite Mario characters and you've got a surprisingly hit game exclusively on the Switch. If you love fun, turn-based games, look no further than Mario plus Rabbids. Another mandatory purchase if you own a Nintendo Switch. While the Super Mario series continues to evolve, it seems to only get better. The platforming, story, and worlds are superb, and the character Cappy is soon to be a new icon in the Nintendo universe. Mario's journey on each platform seems to just get better and better, and with this being a Game of the Year contender, it's not hard to justify purchasing it. It's the core Nintendo experience. It's the reason people bought a Nintendo Switch. Zelda Breath of the Wild tries amazing things with its new engine and gameplay mechanics, returning to its roots in a way. I'll have to admit it starts out pretty rough, but once you learn how the game plays and what you can do, it opens up your eyes to a wonderful experience. It's a must have if you own a Nintendo Switch. Which game did you guys like the best? Which ones did I miss? Let me know in the comments below. For more videos like this and everything else gaming related, you're already in the right place. You're on shacknews.com. You must save her, my daughter. Thank you.